my gut feeling. He's going to go all the way tonight. Well, Benny certainly ticks all the boxes, doesn't he? Cousins Jessica and Dave make up Rob's cheer squad tonight. Girlfriend Tamara couldn't make it, but says she'll be here if he makes it through to the grand final. The two jolts coming. Good dismount. Now the broken pipes. So dangerous early on, but look at him go. What about the light footwork there? So skillful on this course. We've seen different styles, different techniques on the broken pipes. That was as good as any. Can Rob Patterson it? straight into his swing. Poetry in motion. Oh, there's the transfer. Look at him go. The big kick, one swing, and he's down. How good is the robot warrior? It's all you, Rob. Now on the I-beam cross. He's going for a fast time here. I think he realises that if he doesn't get to the top of the chimney, he wants to get as far as he can in the least possible time. Yeah, he is flying. He is something to behold, this guy. He all is 30 seconds faster than Alex Matthews. But look, now his legs have come off the beam. So it's all arms. That's got to be putting some pressure on them. <laughs> You'd think so, Ben. Let's go, Rob. Hey, all the time in the world. Cousin Dave there with some sound advice on the sidelines. No mistakes, Rob. Here he goes, Rob Patterson, up the warp wall already. You can just see why he is one of our returning heroes. He doesn't make a big fuss, he just gets down to work, gets down to business. Here he is, Rob Patterson, up to the salmon ladder. He splits his way through the first part of the course. He knows the second part is even harder. Perfect form on the tramp. Slows his body down. Stops it from swinging. There's one rung. Corrects it. There's two. And completes the trifecta. Now comes the floating monkeys. He's got to take this black bar with him. This is the tricky point. If you miss it, then all the strength, all the weight goes through one arm. Needs to be precise with this one. Yes. He gets it in that ledge. He needs to do it one more time. Oh, he missed it. And then fixed it. Down straight away. And he's still faster than Alex Matthews into the second last obstacle. This is such an impressive run. Stage two finalist last year. Went to stake his claim again this year. After dominating seven obstacles, Rob Patterson finally takes a moment. He's been perfect so far. He'll need to be again on the hourglass to pole clinger. The hourglass has caused no problems for the ninjas whatsoever. It's the next bit, it's a trampoline. You've got to bounce in the middle. You've got to time it right. Reach the rope above. Yes, he's on it, and he's straight onto the pole. He wants this. He's got his eye on the chimney. I don't think he's going to take any time or any rest. Oh. He wants to get right up to the top of the chimney and celebrate here on Ninja Island. Quickly getting into the chimney, scaling up four metres. This time is unbelievable. At the moment, he's over a minute and a half ahead of Alex. Looks like he's slowing down just slightly. Feeling the burn, but he's going to get there. What an extraordinary athlete. Yes, Rob Patterson. That was insane. This bloke is a machine. Perfection from Rob Patterson. So cool, so controlled. He never looked in trouble. He was always a step ahead of Alex's time. And he put his foot down right at the end to finish in a big way.